skip, skip. But when does this game get f***ing good? Yeah. Creating like clip worthy content. That is perfectly shown with the rise of iShow Speed. Plays 2K and he's just slow following, having fun, playing a little bit after school. But then he started to have his freak out. The more he freaked out, the more people watched. Then people realize, okay, he freaks out. Let's put comments in there to make him freak out, saying that he doesn't shower and all those other things. And then he freaks out more. He'll record a video in front of the showers, like, oh, you guys, I shower. Like, come on, that's a stupid thing. Everyone knows people shower. It keeps going farther. Then he starts to get big. Then he's doing those, he's doing streams. They say, all right, I'm about to hit 200,000. His streamers will see he's getting close. Then they'll all start unsubscribing to, just to watch him freak out. And when he's by himself, it's fine. It's just him playing a character of being funny. He is getting issues where he's, when he's getting with like Aiden Ross and going on these other streams, like the Discord dating, the internet dating things. There's a clip where he's talking about, it's the last two people on earth. Would you like make more kids? And this girl's like, no, because then our sons or our daughters might have to like, like marry each other, like incest. And then he's like, who's going to stop me? Who's going to stop me? And he just wouldn't, he just, he was gotten his character and forgot where he was. Well, it's not about the content. It's not about like the actual content value, the idea of what they're trying to provide. The only thing that they're trying to do now is create clip worthy content because you have a moment. This is something that new social media has really provided a platform for is very, very clip worthy content where someone does something so outrageous that you can clip it for 20 seconds and then that goes viral. And that's what I show speed really did is like he created content where he would freak out for 20 seconds. That becomes a big clip that becomes viral. It draws in a new audience. He's a streamer and you know, you're trying to figure out what the hell is he doing for the other two hours that he's streaming. What that has essentially turned into is just a complete degradation of a human being where he just freaks out for like two to three hours. And that's, that's good enough to draw people in. People will go on just for those moments. People will go in and timestamp every time he freaks out. So people will just watch him scream and freak out. They won't even watch the context. They just want to see some of him scream. Yeah, it's funny. We've all seen those clips where he's screaming, breaks his, like he rips his shirt off, all that other stuff.